Hi, welcome to KSF Motors, the holiday edition. Um, out in the middle of sunny Florida, we're bringing you all kinds of fun things with a camera using a Drift HD, a Sony Action Camera AS15, and a GoPro and a waterproof camera. Swimming with it in the sea. I'm done, done. Oh, Everything's yeah. better. Damn it, it's better. Take it for me. Oh, man. <laughs> 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 Thank you. 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 you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, the card part. That was fine, boys. I feel completely fine. Really? Yeah, I can see. So, yeah, what time is it here? Uh, so like seven. Seven o'clock. So it's seven o'clock here, and it's midnight back home. Yep. Oh, shit. Yeah. We've spent a whole day in an airplane. What do we do then? I don't know. Let's walk around. Let's go to Walmart. Walk around the house. Yeah, let's get, get some booze and get load of barbecue stuff. Yeah, fuck it, why not? Whoa! Someone's <laughs> <laughs> got no clothes on already. Bang! Bang your leg. Bang! 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 <laughs> See what they're doing there, shall we? Stop there. Yeah. Air hockey van and games. <laughs> Stole your camera. I've got my own camera. Ah, uh, what? How many? Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> It's okay. So where are we? We're in Florida at the Florida Mall on JR Radio. It's uh, Cal's best radio voice. We're just here chilling out, doing what the fuck ever we want to do, doing whatever we want to do. Um, it's uh, I think about 22 degrees right now. Standard T-shirt weather. Pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, we're just uh, you know chilling out. Ollie's got his uh, GoPro. He's got his. Uh, he's going pro right now. He's going pro with his GoPro. You need a selfie stick. Need a selfie stick. I haven't got one. Hey, selfie stick. Where is that? I don't want one. Do do? I don't particularly want one. You can constantly look at yourself. Ah. 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 He loves it. Oh. So yeah, let's uh, 
Let's go see what we find. I check my hat. I just find an ATM. ATM. I know an ATM as something else. James, what do you know an ATM as? <laughs> see, see. I think they've got Ass to mouth. I think they got the wording a bit wrong in America. Dodge. <laughs> Oh, oh. It's R1, I oh. promise you. No, it's not, it's got a roof rack. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is, sorry. <laughs> that's not, oh, sorry, that's not R1. R1's there. I know, it's the problem, isn't it? Probably the same people. Fuck, it's hot. Oh, oh. Look, how cool is this? Oh, skills, buff. Just standard. Have you got enough buttons and shit on there? Have I got what? Have you got enough buttons, sticks? Mate, there's all kinds of shit. All kinds of weird things. I'm going to be doing like a full walk around of this thing, a little review in a bit today anyway. Sweet, bro. So basically, um, Cal, what are you doing? Smoking hair. Hobbit. That's all they're talking about. This is what this is. Uh, it's gonna get bright. This 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 whole week, well, this couple of days we've been here so far in uh, Orlando, Florida, have pretty much just been. <laughs> Filled with Ollie doing oh, random like stuff. <laughs> like playing with a waterproof GoPro. <laughs> and, uh, and getting his ass out a lot. I'm really confused right now. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, anyway, we're going to Walmart. We're going to Walmart. Yeah, we'll be back. Wash up. Lots of months. And I made pancakes. Okay. Please. Bye. Okay, so. This is the car I've been driving in the States for the past week. It isn't the car I would have chosen, depending on the size of the party. Naturally, I'm going to go for something like a Corvette or a Mustang if the party was small enough, but it wasn't this time. So I ended up with a Dodge Grand Caravan. And actually, having driven this now, I can quite safely say that I'm not going to be too happy about going back to my little Vauxhall Astra in the UK, because all the cars out here are bloody fantastic. So basically, for a start, the key's very convenient, and all the buttons do something useful. Um, all the doors are electric, other than the two front doors. Side passengers and boot are all electric. Which is awesome. And uh, actually, despite having seven seats, this still has a reasonable amount of boot space in it, which is awesome. Uh, the chairs are usually further forward than that, so it would make more sense. but. You didn't even have to, to get five people in here, you didn't even need to uh, duck any of the chairs down because all the cases and things fit in the f nice little deep well that is actually here, which is all good. Um, it's very spacious inside, everyone's got a crap ton of leg room. 
all the chairs fold down for more convenient packing of stuff, like big stuff like drum kits or things if you've got them. And uh, obviously the inside is incredible as well. In the front, loads and loads and loads of legroom. Um, there's two storage compartments, there's the main glove box and then there's the bit underneath the central console. You've got two cup holders in the middle and two little storage compartments in the top as well and the front one has the power points in it. Um, so yeah, it's uh, pretty, pretty in depth. So naturally all the windows are electric as well. Driver door can control all of them, all the all the others can control the rest of them, but out here to be honest in Florida you don't really want to be screwing around with windows, you want to be screwing around with aircon because that's what it's for. It's bloody hot out here, it's uh, 9 in the morning and I'm already sweating one out, so so it's really really comfortable to drive. Um, it only has about 22 miles to the gallon, that's pretty standard for, uh, for a massive engine, in fact I'll get the engine bay open in a second. It's um aircon unit and everything, the central control on here, and it's got a pretty standard CD player radio, which does have an auxiliary input, which we didn't use. The interesting thing about the United States of America is that most of the cars are automatic, and most of the extra shifters are above the steering wheel, next to the steering wheel, as opposed to in the middle um, <laughs> of the central console. So it's um pretty decent. Basically completely electronically controlled. Really nice to drive, like I say. It obviously warns you if there are any doors open and shit while the key's in. Lights are at the side here. Um, it's pretty standard, really. It's um, a pretty decent drive, very smooth. And it's running a 3.6 litre V6, which is pretty nice. Pretty bog standard, really. There's nothing amazingly special in there, but it's, um, I think it's cranking out 280 brake horsepower, which is faster than the GTO I owned. <laughs> and it is faster than the GTO I owned. It's very quick off the line. I think it's 0 to 60 in about seven seconds. So for what classes in a mini, as a minivan, it's pretty freaking awesome. So but that's pretty much it. There's nothing else really to talk about. I'd highly recommend this car for anyone that comes out to the United States at any point if you want a decent smooth ride uh, and have a sizable party but not stupid if you had a stupidly large party you'd probably want to go up to the next sort of uh, 12 seater or 15 seater depending on who you've got with you naturally I'm going to pick something like a Mustang but that's just me if the party is smaller so so yeah just uh, do what you want but this car is very good and I can highly recommend it What? What?